Good morning, everybody. From Tucson, Arizona. Where it's actually colder than we expected it would be, but it kind of warms up during the day. This morning we have a ride on the smart trainers. It's kind of crazy since we came down here to ride outside, but our coach gave us some like really specific short, hard, fast intervals, so easier to program that on the kicker and get like the work done, and then we actually have a ride outside this afternoon. So it's like 30 seconds at like 340, 15 seconds at 185, eight times, times three. So mad. All right, I don't know how much of that I actually captured, but we're doing the hard workouts. It takes pretty much all the mental effort just to complete the session, so. All right, we're here at the pool. Paul is taking a nap in the back. We needed to restock on some groceries, so we stopped by the grocery store on the way here. And I think that pretty much just like took the last little bit of energy that we had left after that uh, the bike ride, so. It is now 45 minutes later. Paula is in a wonderful mood. No, I'm not. This is not at all the plan that I had uh, for this episode. This pool is freaking amazing. Okay, um, we just got back from the pool. I, my, my camera battery died, and then I all, instantly realized that I also forgot the GoPro. Now we were gonna get ready to go for a bike ride outside, and it's like the one day that it's gonna thunder and storm in Tucson, so we're gonna have to ride the trainer again. So we're just, we're, we're, we're calling it, and we're gonna, we're gonna start over again tomorrow. The reality of, of try, trying to do these things is that Sometimes stuff goes to plan, sometimes stuff doesn't go to plan, and you don't always get all of the footage to show it either. So we'll see you in the we'll see you tomorrow. This looks like a disaster. What's the problem? Uh, so basically I s slammed this into the bush and this thing broke off and to get to it I had to like take the entire drone apart. Cause there's, yeah, anyway. Gonna order another one of these. Hopefully the camera's okay. Did it crash into a cactus? Crash into a bush. <laughs> Make this as epic as possible. I came up specifically to get the Romero. Because I got a bit of grip on them.
That is that. That was a solid run. We had to hit a couple stream crossings, had to figure some stuff out, but made the best of it. When we got to a stream and I, we couldn't figure out how to cross it, so I just took my shoes and socks off and crossed it. And that's the end of that awesome story. <laughs> <laughs> so the original plan that I had for this episode was one of my sponsors, Recoup Fitness. They, got, they make this. Um, they are doing this thing this month focusing on accountability and we're wondering if we'd be interested in doing something highlighting the ways that we keep each other accountable. Obviously this week has not gone to plan at all but it's really kind of made me realize one of the bigger sources of accountability in my life and that's everybody who watches this. It might sound a little ridiculous but like knowing that at least some of you are looking forward to watching this every Sunday morning and stuff like that well motivates us to to film and motivates me to edit when I don't really feel like it and stuff so Paul and I obviously keep each other accountable on a daily basis In the last couple days we could have easily skipped a workout <laughs> just with how ridiculous everything has been but having each other really helps a lot so anyway these guys are awesome they're a really cool company really cool product this is basically just an ice ball is what I call it um, they call it the cryosphere but it stays super super cold we can keep it in the van for like five hours and it'll still be cold and it's been making a big difference for me as I'm trying to work through some plantar fasciitis that I got. So I'll leave a link in the description. Check them out. Really cool company. I think it's time to go swimming. Here we are again, thanks to the absolute magic of Amazon. Same day shipping. Little replacement part for this guy. I'm gonna take a crack at this. And if I succeed, tomorrow morning, third time's the charm. <laughs> 